up guys, Dan Kaplan here from Inside the Cross. Really excited to be introducing and implementing more video breakdowns into IL content. And today we're going to start off with a video evaluation. Today we're going to take a look at one of our IL Evo Shield Class of 2024 top 50 players here. Starting with a 5 star headed to Maryland, Spencer Ford. And we have a ton of film on Spencer that we got to dive into since he played recently at IL's Elite 8. So let's go ahead and dive in. Alright, so our first clip here is going to start up in the righty alley. We're going to get a highlight here on Spencer in a second as this dodge goes so we know exactly where he is. But he's going to be our outlet at X and going to catch it with his toes real tight to the back of the crease and put this defender down here in a really tough spot. So there he is right there, like we said, with his toes up against the crease. This defender now has to decide how he's going to approach. He starts off probably on the wrong side of the pipe but that's gonna be another story for another day here and so now he's in this hang up here and Spencer is just kind of gonna work this and manipulate it until he can get a step I think the whole time he knows he wants to attack the goalie side so he's just baiting that defender to step around that way so that he can attack the goalie run through that physicality at GLE and then let that thing go as we watch his clips here he, he's just pretty much constantly operating at another level in terms of IQ, um, just kind of playing the nonchalant card, really like kind of selling, playing dumb body language, and then, you know, making you pay for lulling you to sleep. This clip is awesome. I'm just going to let this ride here, then we're going to get it double back here a second, but... You know, really slick stuff here, getting this feed off behind the back to an open cutter inside for a goal. And so, like I said, we're going to get this thing played back and watch it from the start. Um, you know, it's the clip so nice you have to watch it twice. And so, like we said, he's going to kind of just play dumb here for a second. Hard plant off that left foot, which is now going to give him a step right from the start. Now he's drawing eyes, draws a slide. And the reason he throws this the way he does, right, he could step away and probably throw a regular pass overhand, but it's the quickest way to get the ball out of his stick before that slide is in his hands and it's on the money. So this is just a really, really slick play. Smart to understand the, that the slide is coming and get it out of his stick the way that he did. All right, so this next clip actually doesn't even result in a goal, but I think is one of my favorite ones for kind of fitting the theme of uh, Ford and his IQ. And so here they're going to go two-man, get a switch on this, and so now he sees right away. He's got a short stick. He's going to draw a ton of attention from the defense. So the first thing he does after he makes this move, he gets his head up and starts reading the field. So boom, makes this move, head is up. Not only does he see these guys, but these guys all have eyes on him, right? Everybody's ready to support, so he knows he's not going to be able to just turn the corner and score one here so now he's just kind of slow playing this slide trying to get him to fully commit so that he can step away and make him pay as a feeder right and just continues to work this at this point here he's gone back that hot guy inside and now he's just kind of driving to get this adjacent pass forward get him to show just the one step that he does so he can throw this thing into space and let this step down happen goalie makes a good save here but like i said this is a really good clip to just show off a little bit of ford's iq and his understanding of offense now we have a couple clips here in a row where he's going to work as an off-ball piece and frankly you just can't afford to have many lapses when he's out there. Um, and so in this instance we get two headed to the ball, one off of him and then one off of that other crease guy. That's going to open a ton of space that he's just going to fill and make this finish look like he's done it a million times. Right? So catches that thing over the shoulder, wraps that around the goalie, quick little twister finish and the ball's in the back of the net. Again, we're going to find him working as an off-ball piece. This time it's going to be off of a shot out of bounds. The ball's going to be at X here. And this one is just silly. All of you lax nerds out here that are actually watching these uh, are going to appreciate this probably as much as I do. right? And he's going to just use his body, shield his stick, catch it, and wrap it around the back of his head and finish. I know at this point he's got a bit of a reputation for plays like this, but still, it's just silly. And I think the world of the defender on him here, so it just adds to the impressiveness of this play. All right, and our next clip is actually going to be a set play here. I believe this is right out of a uh, timeout or halftime or a quarter break or something. So everybody's on the same page here, and he's going to start just kind of playing dumb, acting like he's clearing through, sees that space, accelerates through the cut, and he's going to bury that thing 100 out of 100 times. You know, he's one of those guys that you can just tell has had a stick in his hand for a long time. So the composure and all that type of stuff when you get in tight is certainly there. 
And our final clip here for Spencer's breakdown is going to be an EMO look, right? So they're going to start in a 2-3-1, rotate into a 3-3, and he's going to work that top center spot. And so as this rotation happens, let's just see how quickly it is in and out of his stick, right? He makes the read just about before he even catches the ball, and so he's going to be in a good spot to make sure that that ball is on the money so that Justin can just catch, turn, and finish. All right, so that'll do it for Spencer's video evaluation. I think it's pretty clear that, um, you know, he's just operating on another level in terms of stick, um, IQ, chemistry, composure, all that type of stuff that makes for an awesome offensive threat that is really just out there playing instinctually and having fun. For information on how to receive your own video evaluation, click the link to get evaluated now under the analysis tab of your player profile. You can also reach out to get evaluated at InsideLacrosse.com for specific guidance on how to start your evaluation process.